Hi. So I'd like you to meet the Reaver. It's based on the Arch Method 143 and was also stolen from Cyberpunk, as you can tell by the stock wheels. It's very close to a bike in that game. And uh, it's a little special because it's broken. <laughs> it has the speed glitch of the Gargoyle and lesser known, the Fagio also has the same thing where if you wheelie, it basically clips into the ground and goes super fast. Um, Bruffy's testing put it well above the fastest motorcycle in the class normally. It's it's just behind the Gargoyle's glitch speed, and it's number six in the motorcycle's class around a lap. So, um, yeah, it's a little broken, and for some reason the backrest uh, puts on traction, so that's cool. I Those are ugly, so I'm not going to do that, but yeah, this bike's pretty unique so far. I think it has a unique engine sound, too. Super brakes, it has level two. Oh yeah, so I did bring this on um, with DMO, so it is modded. It's got a, I think, brushed steel texture. The secondary is matte red, just because to, to get the matte red, um, to get a nice red. And the plate says Arch 143, because that's what it's based on. Uh, the stock wheels are meant to match the secondary. They don't look like it right now, because the stock wheels have a weird coloring thing. You'll see. Um, when I change the wheels. I'm thinking track stars, but we'll see. Uh, quad exhaust looks pretty good. Why not? I'm not going for an exact replica of the Arch Method 143 or anything. I'm just doing what I want to do, but I do like the two-tone of that front mud guard, so I'm going to go with that one. Bridge C... I like just the painted seat, honestly. I'll just go with that. Horn, I don't care. Uh, lights, I have white lights on them from the arena, so I'm just gonna keep that there. Uh, ooh. That's actually really nice. I might put that on. I'm gonna skip it for now, but that might be a winner. The Reaver, that's pretty good too. I'll have to, I just have to see the wheels. Um, so far the customization is about what you'd expect, honestly. Interesting. So they have a couple two tones. Racer mark. How is the license plate? Oh, I thought it was attached to that. I was like, how, is it just standing on it? But no. Um, I'm just gonna stick with the stock one because it matches the front. Why would I change it? Crumblum. No, thank you. Super transmission, turbo tuning, wheels. Okay, so I'm thinking track stars. How do those look? Oh yeah. Is that even a question? The full, the solid color is not the move, I don't think. And most of these wheels are solid color and it does not look good. Yeah, that looks really good. I'm fully okay with that. Um, custom tires? Hello? Oh, okay. No, I'm good. Uh, tire smoke can stay white. Windshields, okay. Oh, so they they, uh, they poured it over the tuner's windshields into this. Okay. And then they have two different styles of windshields, but you can't get the colors on them. Got it. Got it, Rockstar. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh, man. I like, I like the Bozu, the full Bozu, but I want the Iridescent, too. I'll sacrifice it. Why not? Uh, and that's it. Okay. 18 options. That's not great, but it's a motorcycle, so I guess it's kind of understandable. Uh, yeah, I think I'm good. I just really want to see this thing uh, do its top speed. So that's what we're going to do. Let's see it. Come on. Oh, man. Finding a stretch of road to be able to do this on. That's a car. Oh yeah, it's doing it. Oh, that's just a, that's that's only sort of broken. That's fine. <laughs> it's just like the gargoyle. It's the same thing. How do they mess this up? <laughs> They've messed it up three times now. The gargoyle, the fagio, and this all have this problem, which it's a it's a fun problem. I'm not complaining. I. Like, I'm down, because broken stuff that's fun in games is one of the best things you can have. Yeah, that's ridiculous. 
The exhaust note's definitely unique. I don't think I've ever heard this on anything else, a car or a bike. I could be wrong, but, ow. I mean, it sounds meaty at idle too. Listen to that. Not bad. I mean, it's a motorcycle that has nothing crazy. I mean, other than the top speed glitch, it's just a normal motorcycle that's based on half real life, half cyberpunk 2077. Um, for 1.9 mil, that's, I mean, I don't know. If you have money to waste, why not? But, uh, the gargoyle does go faster in a straight line, and it's way less expensive. So that would probably be the one if you just want to go stupid fast, but, um, it's still fun. And maybe if you're a skilled uh, motorcycle racer, you can use it to your advantage. I don't know if this might become the meta now because of this glitch, it being so broken. See you later. Oh my, rest in peace. Okay. Yeah, I approve. I approve because it's broken and it's fun. So, uh, thanks for watching. I'm probably going to put this in my garage and never drive it again, but remember the fun time I had with it just now. So, uh, yeah, that's the Reaver. See you in the next one.